uh, imperfected, which is more realistic case. So same examples, but different prices, different scenarios. Uh, the structure of imperfect hedge is very similar to the perfect hedge. The only difference is prices, the change in the prices in the financial and futures are not going to be exactly the same. So we are going to have eight examples, four for short hedger, four for long hedger. The, the, now let's let's walk through the first four four examples. And again, let's assume you are working for an oil producing company. It's uh, early March. You know that you're going to have five hundred thousand dollars of crude oil ready for the market uh, in December. Right now, the cash market price is going to be sixty dollars. The futures delivering in December is 61 and you are a producer, so you're going to be long in the cash market. So you have to take opposite position in the futures. So your position is going to be short in the future. You go and sell 500 contracts expiring in December uh in the future in the futures market and let's first example let's assume time passes time passes and prices go down right first two scenarios prices go down here we can see the spot market goes down 50 cents the spot market goes down 40 cents so it was 61 minus 40, it is 60.60. The example two, which we'll, we'll get after uh, a couple of slides, prices still go down, but change in the futures market is larger than the spot market. You can, you can see the spot market price drops 40 cents, uh, futures price drop 60 cents. Right now, let's work on the first example. First example, so price drops in both market, but uh, in spot market drops with a bit more than the financial market. Okay, so here's the table. Today, it's uh, March, spot price $60. Uh, December futures are going to be $61. So we take a short position, uh, 500, we short 500 contracts uh, delivering in December, right? This is the hedging strategy. Time passes, market is bearish, price drops. Price drops 50 cents in, in the cash market and 40 cents in the financial market. How much do we lose in the cash and the financial market? How, how much are gain and loss in the, in, in the uh, uh, cash and financial market? So here we can see, we aim for $60, now price drops. We are seller, so we make less money. Price is down. How much money do we lose? The difference between these two, right? 50 cents times 500 barrels, 500,000 barrels of crude oil, right? So this is going to be 50 cents times 500 barrels of 500,000 barrels of crude oil, and it is going to be $250,000. What happens to the financial market? That was a loss, right? Negative. Do we make or lose money in the financial market? Short position, bearish market, making money. How much? The difference. We sell at 61, we buy at 60.60. .60. How much do we make? We make 40 cents, the difference between these two times 500, right? So this is gain, 40 cents times 500. And what is the net? $500,000 of crude oil, right? So I have the, the calculations here. We lost 
In the cash market, we gain 200 in the financial market. So the net is minus 50, right? So in this hedging strategy, we ended up losing five fifty thousand dollars right so hedging is still efficient it didn't eliminate the entire loss but as you can see this minus 50 is a lot less than minus 250. under this hedge we still lost some money but this is far less compared to minus two hundred fifty thousand dollars right so hedging is still effective the net is not zero we may we lost some money but this is far less than if we were not hedged second example prices drop still market is going to be bearish but it drops less in the cash market cash market is 60 dollars right now it drops 40 cents going to november futures futures right now is 61 then it drops to 60.40 cents so in futures it drops 60 cents set on setting up the table right now 60 dollars going down uh, to 59.60 in a cash market do we make money or lose money we lose money we are seller price goes down we get less money how much the difference between these two which is going to be 40 cents times these 500,000 barrels of crude oil which is going to be 200k dollars financial market do we lose or gain money short position bearish market so we gain money how much the difference between when we open the position compared to when we close the position this difference is 60 cents how much money do we make 60 is the difference times 500 thousand barrels I have the calculations here we lost two hundred thousand dollars in the cash market we gained three hundred thousand dollars in the futures under this hedge what is the net one hundred thousand dollars so in this case we ended up making money under this uh, hedging we are protected against this loss and also we made some extra more cash right 